Well, the family wants answers after their beloved dog was shot and killed on a walk. A detective went out of her way to get that dog cremated. And Amy Cutler talked with the owner and the detective who are both eager for justice. This is a case that has stuck with Detective Heather Krim. And while she couldn't bring this dog back, she tells me at least she could bring him home. He was amazing. Cecilia Moreno was the owner of that golden retriever, Ollie. He was like the happiest dog I've ever met. And I would always tell people, I'm OK, I have my dog. That's why these last few weeks have been so hard on Cecilia. Police confirm she was taking Ollie on a walk back on the night of December 27th near 79th Avenue and Lower Buckeye Road when a man came up and shot the dog for growling at him. Cecilia called police and waited with Ollie. He died. It doesn't feel real until I go home and I don't hear his footsteps anymore. In cases like this, she would have to go pick up the remains and then pay to have him cremated. That's where Detective Krim stepped in. I just wanted to alleviate the stress for her because I know it, it is stressful to go pick up cremains of your animal after it's, you know, been pa after it's passed. She did it without Cecilia even knowing and then brought the urn with his ashes to her. It took me a minute to get out what I was doing. We, we cried a little together and it was, it was really good and I really appreciated it. It made me feel good um, just to help and, and sympathize with her. She lost her dog. Cecilia took that urn up to Sedona this past weekend to spread some of Ollie's ashes in a place he would have loved. It helped start that healing and I appreciate her so much. Police still looking for the shooter. Detective Krim admits there isn't much to work with. They don't have any video, no license plate. There is a thousand dollar reward being offered in this case. They are hoping to bring Cecilia closure. In downtown Phoenix, Amy Cutler for Arizona's Family.